Okay, so I'm just working on a league table here uh, based on the Irish uh, Premier League in soccer. Um, and we're going to learn how to alternate colours, uh, do a m multiple sort ranges, or sort multiple ranges out, and do a spark line. Okay, so the most important part of this lesson is the multiple ranges, okay? Because we want our table here to be organised on points, so the highest points at the top, and also uh, on goal difference too, in case we have teams on the same points. Okay, so um, first of all, we'll do some alternating of colors. So highlight the cells that you want to be formatted. Go down to alternating colors and just choose your style. So white and green, or you can choose whatever color you like, okay? And then click done. And you can get it to, choose, to change the top one if you like. All right, so that would be your top team in a different color. Actually, we might choose that. Top team, different color, and then alternating colors. Okay, and then click done. There we go. So, so it's telling us now our top team, uh, Bohemians, nine points. And then we have Derry on 13 points. So it's not right, okay? So we need to organize the data now uh, with the top team at the top, all right, so that would be draw to here. Okay, so let's select our range again. So just the, the whole range we want to, to sort out. And then go uh, data, sorry. The whole data we want to sort, go sort range. And we'll sort it first on column I, which is our points value here. So we'll look at column I. So select column I, and we want to sort it from the highest to the lowest. Okay, now we'll add in another column. So secondly, after the points value, it would look at the goal difference. So we'll put in another one now. So we'll then see, sort by I and then by H. Okay, and again, we'll go with highest to lowest. Okay. And there we go. Now we can see that Trada have the highest points. There we are in second uh, with 13 points and a goal difference of nine. And see, Dundalk also have 13, but they have a lesser goal difference. Okay. Now I also put in a simple formulas for calculating the goal difference. Uh, yeah, so I just, it's just one cell minus another cell. And then, and this one here, the points, overall points is C2, which is the wins, multiplied by three. So you get three points for every win you get, plus D2. So plus whatever number you have in D2, because it's one point for every draw you get. So that formula there will give us this one here. Okay. So, um, yeah, so there you go. That's um, alternating colors and sorted multiple ranges done. And you can also do a spark line just to show the trend of the overall picture of the team. All right, so I will insert that again. So in this one here, we want to do a spark line. So insert function, go to all, and then go to the S's for spark line. That says equal spark line, and then select your range. So I want spark line for these numbers here for win, draws, and loss, and then hit enter. So you see we've got five wins, zero draws, and zero losses. They're right down at the bottom. And we can select the bottom corner, drag it down, and we'll see general teams. This is how they're doing, okay. Yeah, and then after that, you can insert a graph uh, to represent the team and the number of points that they have. 